Today, it's all about partnerships. Everybody's partnering with everybody. So for Head & Shoulders, we landed the biggest partnership in the entire universe. We partnered with the big guy. No, not him, even bigger. We partnered with God. Well, pretty much. We became the first brand ever to be distributed in synagogues in Israel. But let's rewind a bit. 50% of people will suffer from dandruff at one point in their lives, but most are unaware of their problem. So, Head & Shoulders, whose brand promises 100% dandruff-free, developed a dandruff self-test strip. P&G's global distribution strategy was print, but we didn't think that would work in Israel. It had to resonate locally in a more powerful way. So we created a new mechanism, divine sampling. Stop scratching your head, uh, unless you need a test strip. Here's what we did. When the Egyptian pharaoh freed the Israelites, it said they left in such a hurry that they were not able to wait for bread dough to rise. In commemoration, no bread is eaten during Passover. In fact, even the tiniest crumb is believed to incite divine punishment. The tradition is that everyone conducts a formal search of the house by candlelight, disposing of any unkosher elements. We bought the entire national stock of Passover kits and added our test strips so that the search for unwanted crumbs would now also include flakes of dandruff. Now heads could be 100% kosher and 100% dandruff free. In previous years, Passover kits could only be purchased at supermarkets. This year, we distributed them via synagogues instead, a first for any brand. We even set up a head and shoulders hotline where the elderly could call and get their homes and heads inspected. By distributing all 250,000 Passover kits in synagogues across the country, an environment free of other brands, we increased Head & Shoulders market share by 35% year-on-year. And P&G plan on doing it again next year. Hallelujah!